Expectant, amen? Just come expectant. Thank you, Jesus. Father, I release the power of God, the fire and the zeal to work out boldly, to proclaim him boldly with fire. But I will release a new fire in her belly. I will release a new fire in her belly. For out of her shall flow rivers of living water. May Kopali Ketele Mambradi cause her tongue to be on fire for you. Cause her, her spirit to burn for you, my God. To proclaim you, my God, in the streets. At our workplace, my God, in her city, in this nation, in the name of Jesus. I will leave the fire in her bones, my God. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord is giving me joy. See what's in it? Bringing joy to you. Joy to your spirit. And God is saying, whatever particular you know, my changes. When God says, I'll finish you as a friend and a relationship my generation. That's what he's saying. And he says, that means you bring peace to your spirit and in your heart. So you need to operate your sins. God says, I will not cause you to come. And I'm saying that God is saying, I hope he's giving me a focus on you. That you may do the things you should have to do, the things you should do about your will. You want to just say something to the people in this way. What is it? And I speak even unto the whole being in the name of Jesus. I command that every your blood is normal, your pressure is normal in the name of Jesus. Every infirmity 
iron yoke it. This is a chosen vessel. Make all feel a bottle brand it. For by your blood and stripes you are healed. Mount the Baka Pradi. Thank you. Yes, I hear God say. God says, I've seen your deliverance of salvation. That's for the church in this. And God says, because of your faithfulness and standing and delivering and raising up many sons and daughters who are one of the best of you. God says, with long life I'll satisfy you. And God says, because I say in the spirit of the Bible, God says it will not happen. You will walk. In the yes. and God says, I mean, in your own time, I'll see you sitting. You will be the best of the leaders. Yes. 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 Pastor Chris, uh, the Lord wants to do something unusual in this place. Everybody, please just come. Just come and stand here. Yes, come. When you come, come, come here, please. just lift up your hands. Yeah. I'm not yeah. telling you. I, I saw the spirit of God yes. over those dear girls. Yes. And I can tell you, there is such a power, there is, there is such a presence. Yes. Can I have the attention of the people here? Yes. I, I know what the Holy Spirit wants to do. Just, just, just stand over there. Now, the Spirit of God says to me, Man, I, I feel yes. fire yes, yes, I under my yes. feet. Yes. I feel fire under my feet. When I was praying with you, what did you feel? What did you feel? The spirit filled her and she became very joyful. She was very faithful actually. I noticed. I noticed. Where yes. is that? What did you feel? What did you feel? My God. My God. Now, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. I, 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 the Lord has put words on my mouth. Yes. And, and that says the Spirit of God. The Spirit of Authority. 
is settling on this church now. You're not just going to say hallelujah and you go. Yes. He wants to impart that authority. One time at church, a girl that was a prostitute came to church. And she was broken because of her sins. And then the Holy Spirit fell in church. And he took over her body. She began to cry. She could not feel her body anymore. She felt heat, she felt electricity, she felt fire. The Holy Spirit had taken over her. Yes. And the girl who came in as a prostitute started to prophesy. She started to tell me things only me knew. She started to say things only my wife knew. Let me tell you, my people, without the Holy Spirit, you are not, you are a normal human being. But with the fire and power of the Holy Spirit, you become a stranger on earth. Not even the world can contain you. Yes. I'm telling you what is coming on your life right now. Yes. You will speak and things will change. Yes. In my country, a politician had given 30 days for preachers to stop preaching. The Holy Spirit took over me and I gave him 27 days to leave the city. And in 27 days, the president of our country carried him and threw him out of the city. Yes. That is called authority. Yes. That is called authority. Yes. When I see you people, I now know why we came. Yes. No, this power is too much. I, yes. I can't go out with it. Yes. Yes. I, I, I'm, I'm crazy. I'm feeling yes. this thing. It's heavy. Glory, glory, glory. Just lift up your hands and close yes. your eyes. Close your eyes. Don't be Indian here. Yes. Just allow the Holy Spirit. Submit to the Holy Spirit right now. Yes. Submit to the Holy Spirit right now. Yes. Submit to the Holy Spirit. Yes. And just right now, repeat after me, say, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Feel me. Say it again, Holy Spirit. Feel me. One more time, Holy Spirit. Feel me. I want you to use me. I want you to use me. I want you to show yourself in my life. I want my tongue to be yours. I want my words to be your words. I want my hands to be your hands. I want India to see you, not me. Without you, Holy Spirit, I cannot pray to the Father. Without you, Holy Spirit, I cannot know Jesus. Without you, Holy Spirit, I cannot worship in spirit and truth. Without you, Holy Spirit, I am just a religious man. But with you, Holy Spirit, I 
will be called a son of God. Now lift up your hands. And close your eyes. Holy Spirit begin to move. Holy Spirit begin to touch your people. Holy Spirit begin to touch your people. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Let them feel that fire. Let them feel that electricity. Let them feel that heat. Let them feel that glory. Let them feel what we are feeling. Touch the Holy Spirit. Move in this place. Move in this place right now. Move in this place right now. Move in this place right now. Release gifts over these people. Release mantles over these people. Release curses over these people. Now listen, listen, listen. Just don't pray. It's okay. Don't pray. He wants to feel you. Okay, close your eyes. Close your eyes. He wants to feel you. He wants to feel you. He has heard your prayer. Now, right now, there's someone here. You have a prophetic gift on your life, but you don't know. I see that that anointing is falling on you right now. That anointing is going to open your eyes of the spirit. That anointing is going to open your spiritual ears. That anointing is going to cause you to dream. And God will appear to you in dreams and He will talk to you. I'm going to count up to seven. And the power of God is going to touch that person. Holy Spirit, show us that person. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes. Lord. yes. Receive it. Receive it. Six. Seven. Receive it. My God, my God, my God. My God, my God, my God. This, this is another prophet over here. And, and what is going to happen, Pastor? Oh, yes. no. The Spirit yes. of God is. People, lift up your hands and close your eyes. Just receive. Allow me to move. Allow him to move. This happened to me many years ago. Yes. And I tell you, angels began to appear to me. Yes. And God began to speak to me very clearly. These are prophets of God. Sometimes in church, we don't know that God has anointed people in our midst. We keep attending church, but yet we have apostles in our churches. We have evangelists in our churches. We have teachers in our churches. We have miracle workers in our churches. Oh Lord, anoint these people. Feel them. Feel them. Jake, come and lay your hands and let's confirm the gifts of the Spirit in these people. These are prophets. Father, Father, may it be that after we've left this place, these people will be used mightily. They will be used mightily in the mighty name of Jesus. Now, people lift up your hands. Continue. Keep those hands up. I now see, oh, we need someone here. We need someone here. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Pastor, Pastor Doreen, Marakashanda Rabababa. When God is exercising authority in a nation, He uses prophets. When God is exercising authority in a nation, He uses prophets and apostles. He uses miracle signs and wonders. What pastor was sharing today is very true. Something is going to happen in this ministry. You are going to see, oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, my God, my God, my God. I see the authority of miracle signs and wonders over Pastor Doreen. I see it, I see it. 
People are going to walk in this place blind, deaf, and crippled with cancer, with HIV, and God is going to move in this place in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, put authority on Pastor Doreen's tongue in the mighty name of Jesus that her words will pierce like a sword, that her words will cut like a sword in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. People lift up your hands. My brother, I know the power of God is on you. Come, 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 come. Uh, I know you're trying to figure it out. What's happening to you? What do you feel? What's happening? You do do nothing? Are you sure it's nothing? Okay, lift up your hands. Lift up your hands. Come here. And then close your eyes. My Lord, use this generation. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you, Pastor. Now the rest of you, lift up your hands and close your eyes. In this ministry, the Spirit of God says, I am appointing gifts of healing. Gifts of healing. Gifts of healing. Father, in the name of Jesus, whoever it is in this place that you have anointed and they don't know that they have the anointing to heal the sick, Lord, release it over them. Yes. He's not born as yet. That's why. And he's going to give his life to Jesus today. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. You can lead him to Christ. People lift up his hands. Lift up those hands. Father, Holy Spirit, those that you have given the spirit of miracles, signs, and wonders, touch them right now. Touch them right now. Touch them right now. Touch them right now. Fill them with the spirit of miracles, signs, and wonders. Miracles, signs, and wonders. Miracles, signs, and wonders. They'll cast out devils in the name of Jesus. Jake, Brother Jake, Brother Jake, this this woman has a gift of miracles, signs, and wonders. Even that brother, even that brother, even that brother, yes, yes, yes. And you are an evangelist, you have that gift too. Impart it over there. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we thank you for the Holy Spirit that is moving in this place. The Holy Spirit that is moving in this place. People now start to pray. Now start to pray. Now start to pray. Now start to pray. We impart authority. We impart authority over this church. The church of Jesus. We impart authority over this church. The church of Jesus. The church of Jesus, my God and my Father. Now, now listen, this is very important too. Everyone just lift up your hands. This is very important. Yes, Pastor. Yes, Pastor Doreen. The Lord says he is releasing anointing for money. There are people God is going to give a lot of money to support the work of ministry in this church. And, 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 and God is going to use you to help this church. Just lift up your hand. Come, come, come. Oh yes, you're one of them. My God, my God, my God. Give me your hand. Father, in the name of Jesus. She receives that anointing. Yes, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Wait, 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 wait. Yes, come, 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 yes. come, come. Yeah. Yeah. He told me you confirmed that. Come, my God, my God, my God, my God, my God. Come, come. Money, 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 money. My robot shut up. Pastor, Pastor, please help me pray over there. Oh, receive it, receive it, receive it. Receive it, receive it, receive it. Receive it. My God, she's, she's crying. The power of God is over her, Pastor Doreen. She's crying. The power of God is over her. Maria Kashata, your finances are going to increase four times. Four times. Four times. 
I, I don't know what is familiar with you and the month of January and the month of January, but, but something is going to happen in January, in January, in January. This is like 21st. Something is going to happen by the 21st of January. God, I give you praise. I give you praise. Thank you for your change her finances. You change their finances to the glory of God. To the glory of God. I give you praise and I give you glory. I give you praise and I give you glory. Yes, yes. I see him. Mm -hmm. I see him uh, following the Lord by the Lord. Oh, yeah. Like a businessman. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Following the Lord by the Lord. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Uh, I see him overseeing. Yeah. 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 There is something, there is, God is going to do something around export and import. Yes. Yeah. Something. And, 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 he, he will ship in things and ship out things. Amen. You will have big, 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 big shops. And your market will be international. God will help you. He will give you wisdom to make use of the honor. And he's going to bring friends to you that are already connected to the world. Can I pray? Can I pray for you? 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 I, I'm praying for you. I, I'm, I'm praying for your family. What is your family? Your family. Your family. What is your family? I'm not married. Yeah, no, no, I'm not talking about your My yeah, sort of siblings. Right. Talking about, oh, okay. Uh, the, the Spirit of God is telling me to pray against the spirit of cancer in the family. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. My brother also recently he got healed, but uh, they again in order not to come again, he's in USA, so they did surgery. So still yeah. cancer, still yes. cancer. Okay, okay. And 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 and, and God, God is going to make you happy. God is going to make you happy. I, I see very soon, very soon. God is going to take you. Something is going to happen this time when you meet with your family. The Holy Spirit is going to bring salvation to your people. I see a fellowship. I see a gathering. And God is going to use you to bring salvation. He's going to use you to bring salvation. And the Lord says, He will give you what you desire the most. My God and my Father. This is a messenger of love. She's a messenger of hope. Oh, you have such an evangelical spirit. You have such a you love evangelism? Yes. You have such an evangelical spirit with you. That's what God is showing me. And that grace is going to change your family. Cancer will heal. The Lord says he's driving out cancer out of your family. Yes. I see the Lord say you are gonna to have to pray for your siblings and their children. There's a child, there's a little boy. There's a little boy who is not well, but the Lord will use you to make his life well. You will teach the word. You will open up the world for the gospel. You will even open up this church to, the, to other parts of the world. Father, we give you praise. God increase you. God multiply you. God bless you mightily, mightily, in Jesus' mighty name. Now, now there is one more person in this place, Pastor Chris. There is one more person in this place. You have pain here. You have pain here. You have pain here. Please come. The, the Lord wants to heal your back. You have pain here. And, and, and sometimes even when you are getting up of the chair, you don't get up quickly. You, you get up slowly. You have pain around here. Please, please. She's the one? Is she the one? Is she the one? Oh. The, the, the power of the Holy Spirit is on her. Who has pain on the shoulders? 
Any pain, any pain, just come. Any pain, any pain. Any pain. Where is that pain? Shoulders. Okay, lift up your hands. Close your eyes. Say Holy Spirit. Say Holy Spirit. Say Holy Spirit. Touch my shoulders. Holy Spirit. Touch my shoulders. He's touching your shoulders right now. And he's going to show these people that the Holy Spirit has hands to touch. I command that pain to come out of your shoulders in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the power of the Holy Spirit come on those shoulders right now. Another person, you have a toothache. You have a toothache. You have a toothache. Come, 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 come. come. Awesome. Oh, oh, Jesus, 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 I give you praise, Jesus. Jesus, I give you praise, Jesus, 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 I give you praise, I give you praise. Jesus, I give you praise. Oh, I give you praise, I give you praise. Just, just come, just come. To F. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah. Holy Spirit, in the mighty name of Jesus. We command this toothache to disappear. Yes. Let your power come over our grandmother yes. and glorify your son Jesus. Yes. Glorify Jesus' name. Glorify Jesus' name. Yes. We command that toothache to disappear. We command that toothache to disappear. We command that toothache to disappear. Right now, by the power of the Holy Spirit, Raka Shamra Gabaraka, Mabroko Shete, Repopopopo, Ripopopopo, Shanda Rabababa, Repopopo Shete, Mamma, Maraka Shuta Rabba, Oh, Holy Spirit, Rika Rabba Shende Rebaba, Rabo Shita Rabba, Kure Baba Shanda Rabba, Riko Pro Shika Ras, Riko Prasha. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Oh Lord, I give you praise. Oh Lord, I give you praise. You could help me ask her what she felt while we were praying. That the, the power of God. Until mm -hmm. We were praying. Did you feel anything happening to you while we were praying? You're feeling better. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, the power of God has touched you. It's amazing what God has done in your life. Amen. Oh, glory to God. I don't know what you have done here, but I feel the power of the Holy Spirit. Oh, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, uh, we are we are done. <laughs> yes. Mm. Yes, a few words.